Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of the 100 Baby Challenge. If you missed last time, um, Rowan, our matriarch, gave birth to baby Quinn, our 17th child, and we have decided to not get Rowan um, knocked up again, for a want of a better phrase, because it is going to be her birthday tomorrow, and she's going to finally be um, a fully-fledged adult. We still have half her life to go. Um, to try and have as many babies as possible before we have to think about getting a new matriarch so she's actually surprisingly feeling very good at the moment slightly disconcerting it is currently new year's eve and no one has done anything particularly new year's eve yet so should we really be taking care of a toddler so we have two toddlers and one infant that, as always, is on the fucking floor. Um, so, you know what? Mum can come and wake up baby Parker here and feed them. Why is she feeling sad? Oh, yeah, we need to sort those out. Can you feed this kid, please, mother? Breastfeed. feed. Then we need some serious tummy time. Because Parker, oh, is not doing too bad, actually. Yeah, just need some tummy time. So, like, you... Take a feral poo. Can you potty train a toddler? Olive? Joy? Can you potty train Nikki? Why is it this house? It's such a mess, as usual. It's quite a chaotic episode last time. Yes, alright, mother. Tummy time. And then hopefully we'll get to, I don't know, watch the New Year's Eve TV or something. Everyone, if we are working as a team, come on. Everyone has a child. Roll over on the back. Yes. Destroy snow, pal. No, can you not? Can you not go outside, please? Get these guys to go to bed. Um, everyone needs to come and watch the TV. Um, watch Countdown to Midnight. Try to get some sort of satisfaction points. Yes, Mitchell's got it. You've got it. Everyone's got it. Apart from you, kid. Why haven't you got it? Oh, Ivory's here. Yay, right on New Year's Eve. Alright, um, someone want to come and write you in? Write in. Oh god, werewolf and vampire though. You, you need to go to sleep too, young man. You are tired. But yeah, I just need one more gross motor skill. Oh, and a social skill. Everyone can just go to sleep. Can we be mean and ask you to leave, please? Oh god, oh god, there's a toddler up, there's a toddler up. The toddler is hungry. That's okay, there is a bowl of salad right here. Oh, I did some normal salad, that's good. Alright, everyone will go to sleep and we will focus on you, baby Olive. Yay, New Year's Eve was successful for all. Let me pop myself back up there. You are not doing particularly well. What will we get you to do? What will we get you to do? Imagination, I reckon. Ah, oh, we can't use that. We get you to um, draw with llama. Ooh, baby birth certificates. Forgot about those. There we are. So yeah, 17 children. Can you believe it? Alright, just let everyone sleep. Not this kid plays down here. I was gonna say who will be the next one to wake up but the baby has woken up. And now so has Rowan. Yep, deal with this kid. We're gonna feed them and change diaper. Does actually really need it. Let's come and harvest all of these. And then a big birthday breakfast I reckon. Um, cook a grand meal. Do a grand breakfast. Yep. Change that take. Oh, we're gonna have to throw our birthday party. Maybe not at the house because the, it's too many people and too messy, too chaotic. To be honest, maybe we'll do it somewhere else. Mm. But then if we do it here and we actually hire a caterer, we'll get lots of food. Let me just sell these. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Oh, you know what our birthday present should have been? A new house. <laughs> Alright, Parker is hungry. Let mum eat this. 
Oh shit. For fuck's sake. Again. She's not pregnant, she could actually die. Please, please extinguish the fire. Please extinguish the fire. I love how the kids just will come and stand. God sake. That is the past three episodes. <laughs> oh my god, that is ridiculous. Maybe we just need to like buy ourselves a better cooker. Because I think I feel like it's, that's the cheapest cooker. I don't know if does that, does that really make a difference. Oh my god, now they're all gonna be panic stricken. You've got this kid. Um, put Parker down here. Actually, feed Parker, please. And then, tell me time. Quit, Wanderer. All the boys seem to be running away. No, 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 no. Can you come back, please? And go back to bed. Where's everyone else? Stop panicking about the fire. <laughs> We've got no food now. Um, yeah. Come grab a servant of this, please. Mum was hungry. That's fine. Um, just left a bowl of poor salad there. That's fine. Whatever this is here. I've got whatever this is here. Why can't it go in the sink? Oh my god, there's more! Is it because this baby, this kid's pooping? I think so. Um, you, boy, you're not doing anything. Oh, you're cleaning up though, that's good. Alright, mum, can you come bath this kid? Um, Nikki. Um, excuse me? Give Nikki a bath. <gasps> Roll over to Dummy Marstone, yes. So you just need some more interaction. Play peekaboo. Yep, you need social. You learn to laugh. Oh, get mum to come in. Change the dirty diaper. And then have a nap if she can before we throw her a party. Um, excuse me, what are you doing? Oh, okay, that's cute. Oh, we didn't like it though. Two red-headed boys. Uh, where are you going? <sighs> that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Um, excuse me, what are you doing? Are you an adult yet? I forget. Yes, she is an adult. All right, we need to move her out really, don't we? Wait till after the party, because then mum can get pregnant again. Everyone is sad. Yeah, just, just sleep, 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 my boy. Yeah, we'll have mum just nap for a bit. And then we will plan a social event if I can remember where it is. It's going to be as chaotic as Christmas was, but what are we going to do? Alright, mum's up, social event time. Well, I'm going to deal with this kid first. Start an event. Wicked. Ooh, ranch gathering. No. Um, birthday. Party, birthday party, birthday sim is Rowan. Guest requirement, well, all the ones in the house we don't need to include, really, do we? So, Dylan, oh, we're not going to be able to invite them all, actually, are we? See, they look so alike. Have we missed anyone? Ten. No, that's it, we don't. We have ten kids out of the house. Catering, yes, we want. We do not want him. Yeah, we'll have it here. Mm, I don't know what type of music you like, actually. Isn't it talk radio? No, chain station. Um, pop. Can't remember what she hates. Oh, she just likes pop. Don't change it to pop. She likes blues. I cannot see blues anywhere. Am I being blind? Yep. Yeah. Okay, socialise. Alright, letter P and then um Ah, oh, say hi to all the kids, bright and day. Bright and day, bright and kiss. 
Yay, all the kids are here. Pray that someone will look after the toddlers and the infant. Greg! Thank you for coming, Greg. Right in the day. Oh, fucking vampires. Oh, kids in the house. Who are you? Oh, you're our caterer. Discuss me as Why are you popping the cake over there? I can't move it. Put away. Okay, pause for a second. Mm, open. Why can't I, why can't I grab it? Place in mold, but place somewhere I want you to place. Oh, oh, where are I, where are I? Add birthday candles, add birthday candles, add birthday candles before someone eats it. Yes. Let's get her to come blow out the candles. Yay! Rowan aged up into full adulthood, fulfilling dreams, planning for retirement and midlife crises. I'll wait the perfect time to start wrapping up those lifelong goals. Um, no, I don't think so. Um, call to meal. Yay, everyone come have some cake. Too many people in this house. Oh, it's Quinn's birthday too. Let Quinn age up as they do. Oh my god, the house is a fucking mess again. <laughs> Okay, that was fairly successful. I mean, there was an, an actual fire, which is good. Um, let's check on these kids. Okay, you are very tired. You are not napping. You are just going to go to sleep. You are asleep, but are hungry. So we will wake you up and get you to grab a salad. You hungry and need some hygiene so who is feeling best out of all of you no one but you need to come feed this kid um, wake up Parker please I don't think she's gonna make it she's gonna pass out um you there boy come wake up Parker please oh he is going to rage and then we need to my feed not there. Am I am I blind? Alright. Will someone feed you? Um yeah, you can be jokesters. You being fed? You being fed? Yeah. Oh god, he's gonna rage. Oh my god, can you can you not do that? Can you not do that? And then, uh, <clears throat> Parker about that before you rage. Can you do that? Can you do that? Why are you wandering around? Why are you wandering around? You need bladder. Do you, can you? You cannot go potty. You want some attention. You're going to come and play with dolls. Um, is mom going to pass out? Yes, she's going to pass out before she's ever. And you need to come and be useful. Cuddle. Um, change stick diaper. Um, yes, you can like blues music. And then bottle feed. Mum just needs to go to bed. You give bubble bath. Give bubble bath. Give bubble bath. Okay, that seems to be broken. You go take a throw poo. You wake the fuck up. And then you give a bubble bath. Yes, finally. Oh my god. That was stressing me out. Jesus. You, no, you do not go and wake someone up. You, um, go play with more dolls. Oh, no. Oh. Fuck's sake. Okay, you go sit here. Um, play some Sims shapes, please. Oh, I need to move, um, Joy out of the house as well. Let me just do that now. Okay, so what I've just done, previously Kingsley was with Greg and Rahul, but I don't want her to be, and until one of these guys pops their clogs, um, I want her to be separate. So I've moved her into her house, I took a bit of money from those guys, 
um, and moved her into house so Joy can live with her. And I just know, it's, it's so sad. So they originally had, ooh, I think it was two cats and a dog or two dogs and a cat. And also Raoul's mum and stepdad, Michael Bell, the creature creeper, living in the house. They've obviously died, which is a bit sad. Um, so yeah, Joy, move in with your sister, please. Yay. Cool. So yeah, we've now got room for some more kids. Laugh master and unlocked. Wicked. That is literally all we needed. I love the fact that you're just sat there on the floor by yourself laughing. So, um, let's see if I can actually move things out of this fridge now. Yes, I can. All right, mother, wake up. I'll blow out candles for Parker. It used to be before we had the infants that you would hate the thought of having three toddlers in the house, but you know what? I hate the thought of having any infants in the house at all. So this is good. Fingers crossed for an independent one so they can potty by themselves. Yay! Independent! No fucking way, that's great. Oh, and toddlers. And you've already got a thinking level one. Oh, wicked. Mother, put birthday candles back on that, please. And how are you feeling? You're independent. You can go to the toilet by yourself. Go potty. And then, oh, we need to um put another toddler bed in, don't we? So, um, inventory, and we have one down here. Yep. All right. Mum, where are you going? Where are you going? Did you put candles on this? Can you come and sort yourself out, please? Use the toilet. Um, take a shower. Um, get leftovers and then this kid will be aging up soon and go to sleep mama go to sleep and then you baby bean can you come grab some food oh watch out that's that's not great it's not good maybe we need to create like a like a room just to put them in mitchell 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 um just come outside you're here ferociously, Mark Territory, scavenge ground. Don't know how well this is going to do. Oh god, Quinn is hungry. You're just literally right there. Why aren't you feeding this kid? Good appetite. Parker has a good appetite. Cool, cool, cool. You did not eat. You did not have a shower. What are you doing? No, no, don't do that. No. Get out of my house, bloody werewolves. Thought it would be such a good idea. In the fucking werewolf. Don't you, don't you fucking dare. No. You will repair that when you're better. How long does this last for? Two more hours? Just get out of the house. School starts for an hour. <laughs> it starts for Mitchell is now a werewolf runt. Okay, um, you need to just sort yourself out, boy. Right, what was this ability? Is it that one? Will to resist. Get out. Is he gonna stop being a well just before he goes to school? It's fine, we got this, we got this. Um, and Olive loves water. Because you're playing in the fucking toilet. Mitchell's currently at school, skip to school. No, go to school. Oh, school is out for the day, Crocodile. Oh, that's weird. Alright, then you can help. You, come and fix this toilet that you fucking broke. And this. And then harvest all. Mum, give the kid a bath, give the kid a bath, give the kid a bath. Give the kid a fucking bath. Come on. Yes. Thank you. Gardener is here. Oh my god. Hey, you have a birthday. I'll send you a little something I thought you might enjoy. Let's see each other again soon. Oh. Your birthday gift from family is on its way. You're arriving on mail sometime soon. Oh. Oh, royalty. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, she needs to meet a man. She can't go this long. I'm getting pregnant. This gardener. Let me intro, please. Let's get single. Let's just. Hey, you're really attractive. I really love you coming and looking after all my plants. He's. Oh, but I'm not interested in that type of relationship. You would have to like to be friends. Oh. No. Now the sink's broken. Bloke has now just come into the house. No, you're not romantically interested. That's fine. Who's this? Is this man? This is a man. Is it the like Bernice? 
There's a woman. This is mad. This is an elder. Come on, woman. Let's do this as quickly as we can. Um, embrace. Literally just focusing on this. She needs to get pregnant. She needs it. <gasps> first kiss, first kiss. Come on. Come on. Yes. No, she's going to pass out. God, I hope he stays around longer. No! No! Did you do your homework? Do your homework. And then, logic, mother is up. Is he he's still here? Where is he? There he is. Kiss. Brandy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Woohoo, trappy baby. Who's aggressive? Olive is aggressive. Oh, he's not interested in women with women. Okay. Let's just go. Oh! I mean, you're not doing your homework, but that's cute as hell. <laughs> he's a good big brother, really, isn't he? And you still need to do your homework. And play some chess. Liam is home, he is a beast student. He is, oh he's gonna rage, he's gonna rage. Can you calm yourself down? Werewolf. Mm, no, it doesn't have anything to calm me. Okay, stop it. Try to regain control, try to regain control. Come on, come on, regain control, come on. I don't know if that worked. Um, what are you doing? Do you mind? He, he seems to be chilling. Oh my god. Why are you not asleep? Because you have a nightmare. Why? Do some shapes for a bit. Yeah, again, just go over here, dude. Get out of the house. You are stinky. I don't care. I don't care. I just want everyone to go to bed. Quinn aged up. So Quinn is sensitive. These sims are prone to diaper rash, are often picky with food, and can more easily become overstimulated by too much play and social interaction. However, they also rest more peacefully through the night when soothed. I already have a small milestone unlocked, and you can just chill for one second. You, how long are you rampaging for? Your mum just needs some sleep. She needs to be able to go out and find another man. Okay, I'm done. That was kind of successful in the fact that no one died in the third fire that we've had. Um, mum did not get pregnant again. That's fine, because she attempted to woohoo a man who really would kiss her, but is not attracted to women. And yeah, everyone's a bit kind of struggling. We've had our two werewolves rampage, and that's it. So, thank you very much for joining me. As we have another chaotic episode of this 100 Baby Challenge. Catch you guys next time.